details. A state lawmaker calling on Perry High School administrators to rescind any punishment it handed out to students who carried a President Trump flag to school last week. At the same time, that lawmaker hoping everyone can take a step back from this tense fight. Faye Fredericks explains. What started as a day to celebrate the United States at Perry High School is now a battle over free speech. Republican lawmakers want the attorney general to investigate if students' civil rights were violated. Kind of in a whirlwind. Jennifer Ferris says her daughter Tori, who spoke with us on Monday, was disciplined because she supports President Trump. The school says the students were asked to leave campus at the end of the day and didn't go. Whatever happened, the issue has blown up on social media and taken on a life of its own, much to Jennifer Ferris's dismay. If I would have been able to see or even think about the fact that things do get turned around, things do get spun the wrong way. I think everyone was angry that day. State Representative Kelly Townsend is one of 25 state legislators who signed a letter calling on the Attorney General to look into what happened at Perry High School. Townsend believes politics has entered into the classroom and that can make everyone uncomfortable. We've set the example and, and these are the, the parameters we're going to have to try and figure out where, where are they, where's the boundaries and, and it's it's uncomfortable. But Townsend also thinks the school, the parent, and the students need to step back, and the students should not be punished. I think that the anger ruled uh, in that entire situation, and I think that, you know, after having some space between that day and now, I think some cooler heads should prevail. I think everything should be reversed. Faye Fredericks, ABC 15, Arizona.